Welcome, Cancer. So I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful likes, shares, and support. All right, Cancers, let's go in. This is the year of 2021. This is a business reading. Let's see what is happening. All right, Cancers. Uh, Cancers, Cancers, Cancers. You have the energy of the devil. Um, ooh, and a lot of swords energies. You're a water sign. Your best month is going to be July and October um, and November and December. Wow. The first half year for you, Kansas, is going to be rough. Woo. So we have mental conflicts. We have uh, conflicts and competition. I see you guys are dealing with the king and the queen. Okay. Um, wow. Okay, so let's, um, you have a whole lot of hair energies that you're dealing with, um, yeah, you have a whole lot of hair energy, you're dealing with a king of swords, so some sort of an investigation, some sort of a corruptcy, wow, uh, corruptcy, corruptcy with government institutes or organization, you cancers are dealing with a whole lot of corruption, a lot, a lot of the negative uh, situation. You're dealing with an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra. This person is an Aquarian. You're both dealing. So this is like uh, um, some sort of a corrupt situation where some sort of an investigation. Um, this could be forensic uh, investigators that you um, cancers are dealing with. The energy of the devil is in the center of this uh um, and it's about mental, woo, this is heavy, 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 um, six months for you, Cancer. So what we have is the seven of swords. Now the seven of swords is, um, some sort of, a overcoming doubt. Okay. Your thoughts and words are more aligned with the purpose than you think. It is safe to listen to your own voice first and to make the voice heard. You have worked hard to proceed and have integrity. Your life experience and they can be now be expressed as your own personal wisdom. Okay. Listen closer to what has been said. So seven of swords is you're trying to overcome um, a situation because you could have done some injustice to another person and you're trying to overcome it. And why we know that you have in, done some sort of an injustice if, either to you or another person, the energy of the devil. And if you notice, uh, you're, there is some government, uh, there is some investigation. These people could be also corrupted. These people are very, very corrupted. Whoever these people are, they're very corrupted and you have to be aware of this, okay? So is it you that create the corruption because the energy of the devil is here and this energy of the devil has to do with um, consider that anything you think um, you can have or not, okay? You simply don't have access to it right now. There is nothing permanent, okay? So... Cancers, I see you having some sort of a problem, especially business cancer people. You're dealing with some corruptcy, okay? And these are civil servants, corrupt civil servants. So are your civil servants and you got in some sort of a corruptcy cancer because this is showing up. A lot of you, so if it's um prison workers, civil servants or government or who work for the government. So they're going to be finding out that there was some corrupt civil servants, some corrupt people in civil servants, okay? Whatever is happening and transpiring, they're going to be finding out that a lot of cor corruption is, um, is in civil servants. So if you're working in overwrite right government institution organization they're going to be finding out on a lot of conflicts a lot of conflicts they're seeing it they're realizing it a lot of conflicts so month of february is not going to be good because uh, um a lot of you cancers are having mental um mental instability because mental chaos because you have done something and it's as if you realize that they're going to be finding out that you were the one 
that has done it. And I see mental, mental, your mental capacity, whatever is happening and transpiring. I, I don't know if it, you have done it or someone else has done it to you, but there's some sort of a form of corruption. And, you know, whatever is happening, February is not looking good. January is not looking good because some sort of a corruption is about to blow the top. Conflicts in the month of March. I can't wait to see um, what is happening here. So follow me to the other side in order to see the extended when this reading is done. Um, because there is a lot that is going on in the first six months. Cancers, what have you gotten yourself in? There, is, some of you cancers is not even aware that you're under some form of uh, investigation. And uh, you could have lose lo lose your job, but not, was not even aware that you have lost your job because uh, um they're investigating you. So I see um some sort of a situation is happening and it's transpired where you are not even aware what is happening in your world. Um, and some of you are not even. Some of you could be getting the bad end of the stick, and some of you could have done this. So, um, here, okay, so that, and the seven of, uh, um, is overcoming, but here, overcoming some sort of a deceptiveness, um, what was created. Then the devil in, um, the energy, this is a fire energy. Um, so if some of you could overcome, um, some sort of a deceptive play of an Aries and a Leo. Okay, they're going to be finding out uh, where you connected to these people. Uh, you know, did you connect to these people? Uh, and they're going to be um, seeing the link between you and a... They're definitely going to be seeing the link between you and a um, uh, Aries and a Leo businessman. So, wow. So... I don't know what is happening there. Is this your boss? Who are these people? How did you get connected with these people on the work floor? Um, in business, they're going to be finding out. So the first quarter, cancers, you gotta be aware that they are going to be finding out something that has happened and transpired and you are connected to it. Then we are looking at uh, the second quarter. Now the second quarter, um, you could be having problems with tax because I see there are investigating your information and your document thoroughly you can serve in the month of april so um this is like yes um they're realizing um and checking some sort of a documentation and they are definitely realizing what you you can serve they're investigating your business they're investigating your personal accounts um scorpions uh cancers okay and and i see um some of you have an aquarian boss and this aquarian boss is in um uh, investigating you without you even knowing okay so be aware of this so now i don't know what is transpiring but communication is going to be the key in the month of april um, you know, you have to kind of correlate a way to communicate with people in high authority in the month of April. As we get to May, the five, a lot of inner conflicts, you cancers realize that something is coming down and it's as if they're coming close and they're going to be finding out something what you have done. So you cancers, especially between the age of 18 and 45, I see you cancers are... I've done something and trying to like, you know, put it under, like put it under the, the, um, uh, you know, like uh, keep it, uh, but it's, it's coming out. It's coming out and you can't, um, resist this. Um, communication also in the month of June is going to be very, very important because uh, a whole lot of chaos is now here. And it's as if you cancers are the one who have to be finding a way to balance and, and, and hand these chaos because it's as if everyone is coming at you. So they find out something about the connection between something that you and Leo have done 
and I see that you can service whatever is happening. Um, some sort of a competition between you and a Leo, some sort of a um, situation that you got yourself involved with. And I see that, you know, this is just, uh, you really, really, really have to use the join button in order to follow us to the other side in order to see, because this, this is a situation where you're dealing with a lot of legal issue. Um, it could be espionage, um, um, yeah, the intercept of documentation, um, fraud by using internet, that sort of a thing is coming out. It could be your business was fraud, was vandalized through fraud and internet, um, fraud where they break in, uh, a company internet. Um, this is what is happening and transpiring. And I see they are really rig and, and you start to worry in May because you know you did it or, um, you know, the, whoever did it to you is worrying in May. So it's vice versa. But you did, whoever did it, whoever intercept and was on someone else's computer and took someone else's information, whoever did it, they are on to you and they're going to be knowing that you were the one who did it. Wow. Alrighty. For the rest of you, it's a communication, a lot of meetings. A lot of communication, a lot of meetings, a lot of situation that is happening. Um, and you have to be um, on top of your game. Um, it's like a whole lot of reading, a whole lot of documentation to prepare and all of that. Um, that is coming up in the first uh, six months. And it's as if uh, you are going to be a whole lot of conflicting situations. So be aware of this. So then we're looking at the second um six months of this year the second six months of this year 2020 um july is going to be a little bit better for your um cancers the energy of july is um accomplishing and um you know balancing out the first six months okay so july is like <sighs> breathing because you accomplish all of what was going on you could be on top of your game at the workplace, the conflicts, the inner conflicts that you were having, the chaos. There was so much chaos, documentation, chaos, information, chaos. And now you come into um, July and it is just so powerful, so peaceful. So enjoy the feelings of July. It is as if you're accomplished and then all of those issues and situation that was going on. Okay. Then um, we are looking at the month of uh, uh, mm, 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 August. Now, the month of August, you are dealing with a Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person. Some sort of information this person is going to deliver to you, cancers. That is not going to be a happy one. Whatever is transpiring, this person find out that you cancers have done something wrong and they are going to be um, really investigating something that you have done and they're going to be finding out uh, something. So cancers, be aware um, some sort of information. You could be finding out that this Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person um, it could be a, a corrupt civil servants. You're going to be finding out about a corrupt civil servants and you're going to be realizing what was happening, what was transpiring. Okay. Then, um, we, you are definitely dealing with an Aquarian, Gemini or a Libra person, but the communication that is coming in and how this person is coming in with the communication, um, it's not going to be very nice. So let's see what is happening in the transition, the transition. Okay. Then, um, we are seeing the, some sort of a hardship, um, with Aaliyah on the work floor. Um, uh, some sort of a hardship with a Taurus, conflicts with a Leo and a Taurus, hardship. People are realizing that and they're seeing that and is being aware of what was happening and transpiring. So, um, you know, September is going to be one of those really hard months for 
you guys but you know it's not going to be that bad because you're going to be having the energy of the heart energy that is going to be supporting you but january april may and june you guys are you know going to be off balance with a whole lot of communication and a whole lot of documentation that is coming up but this is more communication because they found out that some of you either someone broke in your in your computer or either you were the one that intercept some sort of a documentation and change some sort of a information and i see they're really coming at you and, and it could be a situation where some of you lacked company information and they're trying to figure out did you do it on purpose or someone was on your computer so i see um this is going to be a serious thing um then we see we're looking at the third the fourth quarter fourth and last quarter fourth and last quarter we have uh, seven the seven now this energy of uh, overcoming seven is always overcoming and i see in the month of october you're overcoming some sort of a uh, unexplained event that had happened at the workplace uh, that brought you and bring you in some sort of a creativeness so, and you're overcoming um this whatever that was happening and transpire you're really really overcoming this and you know whoever the uh, situation and whatever that was transpiring some sort of i see they're coming down on a scorpion they're really coming down as a scorpion. Whatever has transpired with the scorpion, they're really coming down as on a scorpion and realizing what had happened and what has transpired. And then we see uh, the two of pentacles. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, November is going to bring some sort of a balance. November balance is going to be coming in in November. Whatever is happening, whatever is transpiring, November is when balance is going to be coming in and this is going to be positive because whatever that was happening, whatever that was transpiring, I see balance is definitely coming in back in the month of November. Some sort of a balance is going to be returning in the month of November and this is going to be good. Then we see December, um, the energy of uh, overcoming some sort of a situation that was transpiring um where you're going to be getting back on in focus you know you're going to be um finding people to re collaborate with because uh, um uh, some of you could be picking up a job way at the far so you see the energy of uh, August is the fire of hair and the fire of hair um, is you know this water sign person or air sign person coming in and said and communicating very clearly an urgent need to make yourself heard uh, and you know some sort of a problematical situation that is going to be happening and transpiring so cancers be aware because this is going to be a shift and shape ship and shape of uh, this year okay a really ship and shape you end the um year in your in, in in the energy of collaboration so i see in december you're going to be regrouping okay um so whatever is transpire in december is when you're going to be regrouping but do not regroup and go back and do the same criminal um things Pisces or whatever that was transpiring but I see some of you are going to be regrouping so because in the month of August some of you could realize that your contract or some sort of a um personal review and that sort of a thing that your contract is not going to be going through and I see in December you're going to be regrouping wow Ken, so what a year so they're going to be finding out that some sort of a data information was stolen and i see they are trying to connect you cancers with that situation a whole lot of conflicts is here and uh, conflicts and problems and i see that this is here 
and um, some of you are trying to rebalance some sort of a, a situation and people are really realizing what was happening then I realized um, that some sort of a um, yes they really realized that someone uh, computer or data or information was stolen and they realized that um, either it was like from your computer or you can just have something to do with it it is a serious offense uh, a very very serious offense so whatever is happening is that they're realizing that this had transpired it is a really serious offense and I see after that uh, you guys are going to re regrouping in December but Whatever you're doing and the regrouping, Cancers, be aware because you like revenge. Cancers, you and the Scorpion like revenge. This is not a time to take revenge. Because if you do something or someone, do, this is not a time to do revenge. If you take any revenge to anyone, Cancers, you're going to be falling even worse than what you're in, Okay. Um, the frequency uh, of this planet and the, um, the energy on this planet and the frequency, um, the revenge, once you are going to be taking revenge on someone, it is going to be hitting you so hard, cancers. I'm warning you guys because of so much air sign. Air sign is about speaking and it's about the thought, okay? So um, your thinking of being revenging on someone is going to be coming back and hitting you. I got to go. Namaste.